Hello everyone and welcome back to YK Recreation. If you've seen the previous video, this red car here was making too much boost and it ended up hitting boost cut. So what happened was when we when we hit about six thousand revs, it just doof, it just cut the power like as if you slammed on your brakes. So we're gonna have a look over now, see. Why it's causing that one or two things, I personally think it's making more boost than it was previously. Previously it was running about 1.2 bar, but now looking at the boost score, just making it at 1.6. I knew I should have left that heat shield off the turbo, because that's where the wastegate adjuster is underneath there. <sighs> so what I'm going to have to do is remove the intake again, get that pipe off and then take that off. So we've got the heat shield off. I knew I shouldn't have put this back on because it's a good uh, it's a good way to now we can have a look, check the car plugs, mess around with the wastegate. So we're gonna leave this off for winter now. Let's have a look, see if we can adjust the wastegate. It's so using specialist fast release penetrating oil. It's not your standard WD-40. I use this on more stuck bolts. Spray a bit of that on there. Let's let that soak in. Let's have a look at the car plugs whilst we're here. The car plugs do look nice and clean and they are not leaking. Right, so to adjust the wastegate, you need to remove the pin out of there, crack that open and turn this in, I've been told. The tunnel was a bit loose, so we're just using this 3 8 spanner to see if we can unlock. Oh, it's quite tight, that. Oh. No. It's not having none of it. All this out with pliers. Let's see if we can... If it will pop open. Can it, yeah? No. Oh, it's, gonna break. it's like it's gonna break so do you know what let's use that new um thing that we got the mr freeze let's use the mr freeze since we bought it we've never used it so we bought this but we never used it crack it shock freeze release spray um this apparently freezes it so hard until it cracks open so let's see if this works and what it's actually like first time we're using this yes it worked wow Mr. Freeze worked man Mr. Freeze worked so if you ever stuck and you can't use heat in these sort of places. Let's put the tin on it now. Use Mr. Freeze. Let's get the pin out now. The pin might be frozen. So that's the little pin out. Don't want to lose this. 
Put this over there. And all you do is pop this up and you just twist it in. So half one. Oh, need to loosen that bolt a bit more. So we've turned it once. Just gonna turn it once more. So that's two full rotations. And that's it, we're just gonna use the spanner to nip this up. So we've just noted another problem. Notice this dump valve pipe here is quite long. So I thought if I, if I get my hand under the side of it here to make sure it's not squished, I noticed it was squished. You won't be able to see under there, but it was squished. So let's pull this out here. We need to replace this pipe. Because what what because it wasn't long enough, this bit was on the dump valve. This had a slight little kink in it, so that can also be causing boost cut. So we're going to replace this pipe as well. So we've got two sets of pipes here. I think this size will be it. Where does it go though? Underneath the wall? Ah, it is a bit more. It goes under. And onto the dump valve. No point chopping it, it's only a bit extra. Yeah, that's on there. We keep this in the car with us, just in case that one pops us, because you notice this one's quite thicker. found out where it's making that hissing noise this clip that my lovely brother has put on yeah mm -hmm. this clip here mate what I told you to tighten up move that move it you know so I'm guessing that's where the air is leaking out from I think we've accidentally increased the boost instead of lowering the boost we've tightened it in instead of loosening it out so what we're gonna have to do is see if we can loosen it the two turns we did and then th turn it two more turns hopefully that should fix the problem that's probably why the pipe popped off because it's making it went to nearly 1.65 nearly 1.7 bar boost i could see it like but yeah let's go is really hot so I'm just gonna splash just little bits of water on there just pretend it's raining little bit of water's come through the vent you know you know just a little bit of rain we don't want to be here for ages waiting for that to cool down so yeah it's raining let's just pretend it's raining a little bit of rain 
Now what we're gonna have to do is turn it. That's half. That's one. That's half. That's two. two. So that's where it originally was. So yeah. now what we're gonna do is turn it two half. Four. One. Half. One. So that's two now. Let's just lock it with this. So if you've noticed, we've loosened it twice, but it's still got a slight little gap where it touches. Because don't forget when the wastegate does work, it has to come out and touch. But it's got that much gap where it's not touching. So I'm, I'm going to adjust it once more. Half. One. See if that fits in there better. Yeah. Yeah. Still. Still got a bit of gap there, you know, where it could touch. First and every stop is the fuel station. Strictly V power. you do you don't want anything to go wrong in first gear yeah the car's back alive people the car's alive the car's alive the car's alive without boost cut look anybody's moving out the way do you see that it is both the way oh that's that dodgy pipe man so we fixed one thing but we've got we've got that dodgy clip on that dodgy pipe. So we could we're gonna have to change that pipe if you wanna go out for the drive tonight. So I was blaming my brother before for not putting the clip on, but now I'm thanking him because he's changed the clip for me whilst I was eating. Oh yes, that's the clip we need, not this shit jubilee clip. Uh so let's hope this one doesn't pop off now. Because we've only got a spare. We've only got one of them spare ones, haven't we? Yeah. You're right. Uh, okay. So we've had to come back in the garden, readjust the wastegate by another one and a half turns in. Because it, it was only running one bar boost. One bar's not enough. So now, me and Oma. I'm gonna have a race for pink slips. I'm joking. We're just gonna go for a little drive test. Oh, yeah? That's fine, yeah. Okay.